I'm going to speak. I want to, um, I'm not raising my hand because when I do, you don't recognize me. Um, I've watched my videos on Jeffco 101, and what I say is included in those videos. Joe doesn't edit those or manipulate public process in any way. And Mr. Yount fails to give us examples of where people's commentary is taken out of context. I mean, I'd like to hear that or see that, where that is. I mean, this is just a desperate attempt by Mr. Yount to prop up your failing administration. I, uh, a couple weeks ago, I talked to Commissioner Sullivan in the hall, and I asked him, what do I need to do when my battery's going dead on my camera? I noticed this video man over here that when he's running out of tape, he holds his tape up, and then you guys recess the meeting so he can put a new piece of tape in there to continue going. And I asked that, uh, Chairman Sullivan, does this gentleman have a contract? And he told me that he did. So I went over to the commissioner, over to the county administrator office and asked Leslie, does this guy have a contract or not? No, he doesn't have a contract. So I'm just wondering why Chairman Sullivan gives me misleading information. Is it to waste county resources? I mean, you sign the contracts, don't you? You would know if you have a contract. But no, that's just a way to retaliate against a critic and waste county staff time. So again, this gentleman here, um, wherever Mr. Yount has seen these videos, I'd like to see them. Because I'm told that they're not on PTT. I'm told that he's trying to get a contract for $6,000 to videotape these meetings, but you haven't approved the contract. So I'm just wondering, where it is that I can see these videos. Maybe Mr. Yount can, can fill us in as to where we get to go to see those. I guess he gets a private viewing, I guess. So again, and I'm wondering why, pursuant to the fire code, this gentleman doesn't need to take a chair out of here, which is required by the fire code if he wants to stand. Number two, I'm wondering why he gets to take up two chairs with his laptop computer, and I'm wondering why he gets to walk around the Diaz and plug in, go in this closet and stuff. He has no county authorized access. He has no uh, county uh, admission tag that you see all these people wearing. So why is he getting special treatment and people like Joe and myself are being treated differently? So maybe you can fill me in, Commissioner Sullivan. I didn't think so. So, uh-oh, we got a problem here. 